I have a couple of questions for you. <laughs> it's okay. nice that we uh, we already met with you yesterday and we have a first conversation and uh, I had so much um, uh, stories about you from other Portuguese uh, members of the Portuguese Federation uh, and it's a pleasure uh, to have the possibility to make uh, such an interview so that everybody else would also you know have the experience. What I wanted to talk is uh, many things actually but uh, the main points the Portuguese Federation you know how it started how, what, what was in the beginning the connection with the European Union of Yoga uh, one of the very interesting uh, you know stories and uh, points uh, that I want to discuss and to talk with you about uh, your experience at uh, in Africa uh, in the military uh, as a yogi yeah because I think it's for Ukrainian people it will be very uh, important at the, at the moment and actually, your opinion, you know, uh, on the war we have in Ukraine uh, with the aggression of Russia. Amandia, uh, how uh, it happened that you started yoga? What, how was it and when was it? What, what's the story behind it? How many years you are in, in yoga and doing yoga? Thank you for this invitation uh, and uh, to be with you. It was a pleasure to, to meet you and uh, the invitation of the European Yoga mm -hmm. uh, Union. And that uh, uh, I am just a simple practicant of yoga, practitioner of yoga and the study of yoga. And yoga starts with me, maybe by intuition, looking for some different philosophy that we live in the 60s in here in Portugal. I have maybe 17, 18 years old and uh, uh, I try to understand what is life uh, uh, with uh, no prison, dictatorial pre the, uh, ambience that we have in that uh, time and uh, some uh, books comes to me uh, from uh, 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 a, a person of the library and in that time maybe I do meditation without uh, know what exactly it was meditation because at the end of the day I start to do some uh, positions without uh, to know what <laughs> is yoga mm -hmm. to prepare my uh, situations of silence then it, uh, it appears uh, yoga uh, from that book. It was uh, an, an individual nowadays. That we know the origin. It was Ramasharaka. And then I start with books from Van Elizabeth and from one uh, uh, that came with me to Africa. These books with the, the professor um, from Brazil. Um, the, the books they, they have, Hermogenes was the name of uh, mm -hmm. the, the professor. And then I never stop until today <laughs> to uh, study, practice and see the, what is the effect that yoga uh, do inside of us. And not thinking about that I'm doing yoga. It's more the spiritual disponibility to, to that the work that we do with yoga is the transformation inside of ourselves. So that's very interesting, the study and the, the help that yoga gives to us in a, in a spiritual way. That's very interesting. How old, how old were you when you first met yoga? Uh, I think it was 16 years old. Because it was in, in holiday time, uh, it was in the beach time, and we, in the, during the holidays, we try to, to have different uh, books to read from the studies. And uh, I had a friend with a library that uh, uh, used me as a, a politician, a young boy, to discuss why we couldn't talk free here in Portugal and to know the, the, the different lectures uh, and so he, he gives me, uh, I give you, I have here some books in that that uh, you, you like that. And he gives to me that books and then I start to see, well, it, this is what I'm looking for. Uh, mm. And I start to do that. 
I never stop. At the end of the day, or all days, I, I now I think that will be something that is connect to me with yoga as a, a life way. But uh, do you remember exactly which book that was that you first saw? Yes, it was the Yoga Sutras of Patanjali oh. uh, of uh, Ramasharak. He says it's the science of yoga. I think it's the book I have. Nowadays I have a bibli uh, bibliotech, big one with the, a lot of maybe a thousand books of yoga and Ayurveda, but maybe of yoga and the same edition. The same books and different editions in French, in Spanish, in Portuguese, in English, and someone in Germany too, that I can be the translations of what it is. But that was the first thing. When I thought, Yoga Shiti Vriti Niroda, what's that? The yoga is the stop of the, 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 the agitation of the mind. And when he starts to say in the first um, sutras of Patanjali, Hatha Yoga Nusanam, that it, it says this is yoga. It's not only the yoga of a thousand years ago, it's the yoga that we do today is the same that it happens uh, a thousand mm -hmm. years mm -hmm. ago uh, and did not change. So it's not a, a modern uh, way. The yoga is that, is that. It's not easy, but yes, it's yes, that. Yes. But you know, the Ramacharaka is uh, an old book. And now some uh, scientists, uh, people from the academics, you know, criticize it because it's not, you know, perfect in the traditional way uh, as a translation, yes, yes. as an explanation, as an interpretation. But so many people have started yoga, even in my country, uh, because of Ramacharaka. He, because if you look, in, if you go to the library and uh, you look for the lists of the books that were in the library in Ukraine. Um, back in the 1920s, 1930s, the main book was Ramacharaka, and most of the yogis in Ukraine, like the uh, you know the generation before me, or I would say two, three generations yes, before yeah, me, yeah. all they had was Ramacharaka mostly. Yeah, it it was uh, very. It, it, I think it, it simplified the the, the the roots of yoga, the texts, traditional texts of yoga. It's easy to read. In young, with the, in the teenager, it was easy to read and move with the minds, puts our minds to think about. Then, and no more. In the, nowadays, I don't say if you want to study yoga, you go to study Ramasharaka. Yes, yes, Not. Yes. But it was, it, it appears, nowadays we have Taimini with the, the, the commentaries of, we have uh, Swami Rama with the commentaries, uh, all the, the traditional yes, books yes. in our class. Nowadays it's easy yeah, with the internet, yeah. with and, uh, yes. all the libraries open. Yeah, yeah. Young, uh, Jung, uh, Carl Jung studied the, the, the yoga, the Bhagavad Gita, so nowadays we have. And the, the science is very interested in the, 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 this, this, yes, this yes. The discipline, this philosophy of life. Where were you exactly uh, when you, you know, where was this library that you were in? Uh, when it was in, in uh, Costa da Caparica. It's a beach side on the other side of Lisbon. Ah, okay. okay. It, I was there to, to, to in uh, holidays, in the beach mm -hmm. time. So it was there because I live in Coimbra. And the Quimbra was a, a place in that time, in the 68, 69, you know, the, the Paris 68, 68 yes. uh, May 68, in Portugal we have April 69, and uh, we, the revolution of the students, and Quimbra is the, 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 the second university in Europe. The first one is, was in Bologna, the second was in Coimbra, and the, the third in Salamanca. In, I'm talking about the 11th century. Mm -hmm. And then it stays like a, 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 the students in that time was revolutionaries against the dictatorship that we have here in Portugal. And so we start looking philosophers, li reading from the Gushist uh, left. left uh, we, it was not permitted to read uh, Marx, uh, and we can read Marx uh, <laughs> That you take a book, so, a lot of uh, Marxism and philosophy, and um, and that's why it comes everything that was against the government. We would like to read and to have and to discuss in coffees and so on. Did you have uh, other friends who were doing yoga or who were reading books on yoga uh, when when you were you know your first years? 
When you met the book of uh, Ramacharaka? Mm, no, they, they, they take that. Ah, that's something like religions. You have, ah, that's something that God, especially, you know, the Brazilian, the, the, the professor in Mojans, it was the first Catholic uh, uh, yoga teacher that could explain to me why yoga can help the, the Christian people. He, he, he is a book, he, he has a book in poems about, uh, about that. It was only that because I said yoga is never a religion. Mm -hmm. It could happen to have some uh, movements, some uh, thing uh, uh, similar to the religion, but it, yoga is before religions, the, the official religions that we know. If, because we study, we, we study anthropology, that some, after that we, can, we have a lot of disciplines that come to help. Chemistry, uh, in the body, biology, mm -hmm. uh, and then we have a lot of things that are going to explain why, what is happening inside of you, why the, the disintoxication of the body could help the disintoxication of the mind and can open another uh, dimension of living. Yeah, mm -hmm. So that would, that's it. But they said to me, no, and then it was a very materialist mind to do. This is must be concrete, never mind. <laughs> so, so you must do, do this. So you were pretty much alone. Alone, in, uh, yes. yes. Maybe one, two fellows would like to, do, to, to talk about, but I don't remember to have uh, some. And when was the first time when you met some, you know, community? Uh, Yogi community. It was very late after the African war. Maybe it, the first concrete uh, connection, it was in the 1981. In, uh, in oh, wow. the, it's much later. Uh, yeah, much later. Then I uh, never stopped. I, I had a friend with a place to do karate, gymnasium, and uh, he, 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 saw, he, he saw me. He was a friend of, uh, for, from the school. And he opens the gymnasium and says, ah, Tino, if you want, you can come to do yoga. And after that, we open some classes. But it was um, like that, just me and more two or three mm -hmm. uh, persons to do not as a class of yoga. But we came, to, now it's time to yoga. You do your sinus, you do your, I do my mm -hmm. breathing. So I'm not concrete. Only in that time when I was, well, what to do with books is not only, it comes to move with the person. And then it, that uh, fellow of the, the gymnasium uh, uh, knew that, um, um, uh, Chris, uh, no, sorry, um, Deshimaru from Zazen mm -hmm. came to, in, in that time, came to Portugal in Cascais, in the same master, to do um, a seminary of Zazen. Which and year was that? Maybe 82, 80, 80, mm. 82. And to you know, understand where we are on the scale of the history, uh, when, what, which year was that when you first uh, read the book in the library in uh, Coimbra? Uh, not in Coimbra, it was in, it was in the, in, it was in the seven, uh, 19, uh, 70, uh, 67, 68, it was, uh, that, that was a Bra in Brazil, it was not in Portuguese, the book, mm. it was from Brazil, because Brazil it, it was free, it was a, a democracy in that, uh, in that time, they, they translate all books, and everything that comes from Ramacharaca, it was in Brazilian, that we call Portuguese, but in Portugal we could not translate that books. Mm -hmm. So, the, the, and is there a difference between Portuguese and Brazilian? Not too much, but the grammar, uh, the way to grammar, to write in the grammar is a little different. Okay. Okay. okay, okay. But okay. it's a Portuguese anyway. Okay. okay. They, they say that Brazilian is uh, Portuguese with sugar. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. That's <laughs> nice. Uh, so, uh, how many years are you now in yoga? Or are uh, you doing, well, how many years are you? Uh, with yoga, <laughs> how, I don't even know when, when I talk about such a long experience. I don't even know which maybe uh, how to five, say. Uh, or uh, fifty-five years. Uh, I'm close to the sixty years of uh, doing yoga. Wow, that's a lot of years. Yeah, yeah, every day, long and, life. And then we go to the, the congress in India, congress in Europe, congress in America, congress in Brazil, and a lot of people that we we know and we are together doing the the same uh, uh, work and uh, 
especially because maybe um, we do this. I hope that, I suppose that yoga is to be prepared to uh, do something for the others, not f for ourselves. Mm -hmm. That's what yoga teach me in this society, uh, especially this society to I have, I have, I have. We, okay, I have enough. I don't need no more. What can I give to the others? I think that's the most important. Uh, one of the most important things that yoga can help the generations. And uh, when you were first reading the Patanja, the Ramacharaka, uh, that first book, uh, can you do you remember your feelings like when you met? Uh, It was very intellectual in the time, not not intuitive, not in, with yoga. The, the, I saw that. Uh, of course, we are thinking, thinking the yoga sheet is written in order. Of course, we are thinking the same way. We don't be open to the other way, the, the other ways. So when they explained in the next uh, sutras, but it was not uh, already the Ramasharaka. I have Taimini to, to, to read the science of yoga mm -hmm. with Taimini. It was, he, he was an chemistry and he was a doctor. And he, he put that in the way that uh, I was needed always to do that. And then I studied psychoanalysis of Freud and with Jung. And then uh, it was uh, the things that we discuss. And then we see that the mind is not uh, to be closed, but is to be open. And then to be open for outside to end to inside, because inside we change too, in, mm -hmm. uh, in the mental way of, of our... Okay. Yes. But uh, I, was more in I, was, I wanted to ask you more about, you know, like when you were reading this first book, What were you thinking, or how were you reacting? Ah, what I this? said is, yeah. well, why didn't it happen more early? Why we don't study this? This is the most important thing, and that it was my um, defense with the, the, to my argumentative points to the other politic when we uh, was uh, with other fellows to study and to say this and that and the materialism way. And they, they said, no, but there are the way of the, the different to see as you can see. And I read some parts of the book. I don't, I don't remember now, but you can see this is you. You think because you breathe. And you, as you breathe, you think because you change your emotions as yes. you breathe. And so that was like that. So the next... Uh, mm, um, Uh, step in life was the military, right? Uh, yes. <coughs> so um, it, in that uh, time we have, we have a war in, the, in, in Africa. We, we were a, a country colonialist. We have uh, f uh, three uh, principal places uh, where the war was uh, uh, a big one. It was in Guinea, mm -hmm. in Angola and Mozambique. And uh, every young uh, man after the 18th Have to be in the military way. Mm -hmm. A few don't go to Africa, but the most part of the military young uh, people went to Africa. So I, I was not to go. I was to, to go to Paris to run away from the war. But that time I read a book of the, the commentaries of Mahatma Gandhi to the Bhagavad Gita. And it was a, a, a big work because the Bhagavad Gita says, says as this way, the text, and uh, Mahatma Gandhi has an interpretation that the others uh, thinkers have too. And he says, if you want to fight for uh, a or violence, the first point of uh, yoga, uh, you have to be doing in the place where there is some violence. And the violence that is everywhere, where is where are war. So I, I did know I go with my fellows, I go to the, to the Africa and try to change everything that I could do inside of the, the military way in, in that. That's so. And my fellow says, now you go to military, you're going to stop doing yoga. Now you're going to see you have no more yoga, something like mm -hmm. that. And There are free times in the, even in the, in the military way. So when the, I was all, all at the end of the day, in the beginning of the day, I always do something with yoga. And with the books, always the books with me. <laughs> goes to me with Africa. Mm -hmm. yeah. So which year was that when you went to Africa? In 1970 to 1974, when came the revolution that put Portugal in democracy. Mm -hmm. And when you, go in, when you were going to the war, Uh, how, what was your attitude 
to the government at that time? It was secretly against the, 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 the government. They tried to do the things that uh, to, be ex uh, to be the winners. And uh, we do the things d not for kill our uh, companions, our uh, soldiers. Our, because it's a, a different war that we have today. In that time, we are doing a, a, a not correct war because it was a possessive way to have Africa as a, a colonialism from Portugal. We, we, were, the, we were everywhere, Timor, India, uh, and Africa, and the uh, American Sul, uh, the South America with uh, Brazil. Uh, I don't know where we, we were colonialist. And we said, no, every people uh, have to be his independence. Mm -hmm. But in that time, that's why a lot of young people ran away from Portugal when they don't want to do the war. So the situation in Portugal in 1970 was pretty much the same as it is now in Russia. Uh, <coughs> so the people, you know, the uh, I don't the know how, how doing... exactly is in Russia, but they take all the young people to do to do the war, and they, I think so. so that's, that's, I suppose it's the, the things that the government in Russia do. Um, uh, uh, to put a person on, as in Ukraine, it takes the, the young yes, people yes. To, do, to, do, to do the same. But the, the difference is that uh, uh, Portugal in that time, is, it was to, to the, the, the position of the Russian, want to, to have the, the, the territory that it was not belong to, to Portugal, it, mm -hmm. the African is not for Portugal. So that's why we, in Portugal, a, a very strong group of persons says not we go we are there but this war must stop and it was inside of Portugal that stopped the war it was the military movement who changed the war in Portugal mm -hmm. not outside so we I was in Africa at that time and the first thing that we I, I hear Portugal is is, is now in a, in a revolution Oh, I was the we and other fellows. We uh, stop the war immediately. Take the harms. We give all the things. Now stop the war. Now it's finished. It was not easy. I was in that time in in Angola in Rwanda. It was not easy, but it finished, and it, it, we are in democracy. It was inside. Suppose that in Russia it happens, the move, a military movement says, no, this is not correct, this is not the way, we have to, are killing young people with 20, 21, 22 years, killing them, and no, it must change this, we have to, women, uh, the humanity is not uh, this, and suppose it, they do that, and then stop. Yeah, that would be very a... nice uh, if the Russian uh, military would hear what you're saying, <laughs> and because the, maybe there would be some kind of movement inside the Russian uh, the Federation the at the moment, uh, which would you know save their own people and their own soldiers and move out of Ukraine. Yes, uh, and uh, when it, you... wa it was what happens in, uh, after the, the 25 April in Portugal in, seven, uh, in 1974. Mm -hmm. After that. All the army, Portuguese uh, militaries came to Portugal and we start doing the independence and the, all of the, they are free countries. Mm -hmm. Angola, Mozambique, Guinea, Cap Verde, they are mm -hmm. free mm -hmm. countries. And uh, when you were going to uh, Angola, uh, what, uh, what were you feeling? Like, you know, you, you know going to be fighting, you know that you already, you already were uh, you know, into yoga and you read books and, as you say, you read the Bhagavad Gita and the commentaries of the Mahatma Gandhi. Uh, when you were going, what were you thinking? It was not easy. I had afraid. Because I could be in a situation face to face with someone, you kill me or I kill you. Never happened. Mm -hmm. uh, never happened. So what I have, it was two ambushes uh, uh, in a situation uh, that it was uh, to be not in dangerous, nobody was killed. And uh, the, 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 in my company, the, the, who dies, it was far away from the place that we, we were. But uh, it was a, a situation that I never leave. Uh, it was to be face to face to kill. Mm -hmm. um, 
and uh, that's why uh, it, it, it was good. But I was prepared to what good it happened. I never know. Mm -hmm. I never know. Because uh, yeah, I was in the place in the north of Angola with the three the tribes. With, uh, and we talk with them. We, we make the, the festivals that they have. The tribes in the in the African, we go to with them, and they have the collection with the the, the army of the, the, mm -hmm. the from the the Gaul. It was it was not so difficult to to do that. But what I do it was to do against the things that could put the our uh, uh, soldiers, the soldiers that uh, are with in in, in a dangerous situation. Mm -hmm. And I will do the things that could not uh, facilitate that dangerous situation. Were you, uh, I mean, you said that there wasn't, uh, it, 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 it was, yeah, you just explained how it was, but uh, did you have any situations that were dangerous or, you know? Directly, no, but, uh, and, and, and directly, twice, twice. Mm -hmm. It was an embassy. Uh, they they are fight they are uh, shooting us, and I was uh, uh, we and other fellows we put uh, protect by a, a car. I I can give you a photo later of uh, one of that uh, big cars, mm -hmm. and then uh, we shoot ch -ch -ch -ch, uh, to the air, <laughs> and the, the, we saw the, ba the 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 balls of the other. Pa -pa -pa. In the, in the ground and in the, um, the, 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 the transport, the, the car. Mm -hmm. And it was maybe half an hour or something like that. We don't, in that time, we don't know the time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when, we see, when we hear the shooting. Twice, one, it was in the forest. Um, and uh, I, I just, in that time, I just, it was just the second day, third day when I arrived. It was in the forest. This one, it was in the street, in one street, when we go to make a, 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 a colon of bio, uh, the transport to go to other place. And the first was that um, maybe one hour of, because it was like this, we was the, um, here. And when we arrived here, they, had, they, they were here. And they shooting us, and we was walking. It was not a, so we protect with the trees, mm -hmm. and they stay. It was the night. They stay there shooting, shooting in the middle of the night. They went away. Mm -hmm. So, so when you were at the you know the situation of uh, danger, uh, or just uh, this, this it it's <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> and uh, is it possible like? What were you thinking, or did uh, did you apply some kind of yogi practice, or? Uh, I think that in that time, did I, yoga help you in any yes, way? Yes, I think moment? later we can think about that. I th we a person think about that because we, you you are, um, you feel some liberty, not not to be, uh, with afraid. We have we have afraid, but we uh, you are disponible to the situation. And you see, I, 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 I never gonna kill nobody. They were far away, but they, the, the, the guns, the ta, 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 ta. Mm -hmm. and the, my, the other militaries, they, they are, they move to take to to, to go to that to, to that people, uh, and they, I stay just in that place because never tell. They say to go. I was in the the part of because I was I was from the responsible of the transports. I was not the factor, in, so but we, we we go everywhere we, when the the transport is needed. We go to mm -hmm. it was all days, and that situation after some time, the silence was the, the guns are stopped, and the, the then uh, the yoga then we saw how could I resist that time with uh, no reaction, no no afraid. Uh, disponibility to be there and do not have no, uh, no uh, nervous system. Mm -hmm. The nervous system was okay and I stabilized it. That was it. It was yoga working. 
Mm -hmm. I could not think about now yoga goes to work like I take a, a pill now a yoga pill no? yes. and then, no, so it, it was, was uh, afterwards yeah after when I go when I was in the my room and I thought well well, well look if, if you are in that situation the problem is not you to be face to face to kill someone it, it was my afraid mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because maybe if if was the if we, we are in Portugal, someone comes to to fight us. Well, in that time, Bhagavad Gita, it's a fight to do. It's Kurukshetra. Uh, I go there mm -hmm. to fight. I don't care if I die or not. It's just uh, correct to do that. But it, there was different. We go to do a, a, a not correct war to occupy the territory. It was not uh, to belong to Portugal. So okay. that's why it was a revolution inside of the, the Portuguese army. And um, any, like, now, now after you analyze this experience in, at, uh, in uh, Africa, in Angola, uh, do you, uh, uh, how would you say which qualities or maybe how this experience has affected you in the long term like when you think about it now how what what was that experience for sometimes you see i, I have some dreams about uh, about that time and i wake up like this uh, during the night but uh, easy, easy so you see it, it was uh, not not easy to 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 have living that uh, that time but i think that uh, with um, with yoga and the reality of life, um, we can uh, put two sides, the, the side of yoga, not against them. So, the, it, but you, you, if you have uh, practiced yoga enough to, to, have, to, for, to have that, to, sit, uh, to be with that situation, if you, you are changing, I have to, something like that, we, I was in the military hospital and uh, I saw such terrible things in young people and some, and you, you do yoga, just you do yoga. We can do yoga uh, from Surya Namaskar to Pranayama and then you stop observing what yoga do in, in the inside of you. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna uh, see that the war is uh, something, the, the, the military service, it was something that is to be uh, with uh, uh, like a samurai uh, courage to uh, to say this is not now happening. So I have to change it, and the science help us to do that with the, the work of yoga. If you in the medicine uh, studies and so on, you can change your mind, changing your body. And, mm -hmm. and then we, it's the situation that um, I have, the, I know the war, I remember the war, maybe other things don't, but the important movement, the decision of some movements inside for, of the, the court, of the, the place that we had, the command say to you, you gonna do that, and you say, no, I don't, prison. <laughs> Have you been to prison back? Yeah, it was a prison. It was the, because it was in the forest. I couldn't go away. Uh, but in in one, I was uh, in the quarter. I, I couldn't see the, the headquarters of the, the military. But in in the forest, I said no. I don't want to say to my soldiers, to my uh, men, to go to that place because it's dangerous. And I, I couldn't do that. If you do that, you are going to see. The, 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 I can see uh, you have a post. And they want to, to put the post down. I want to t take you down to the to be soldier, not a, a, a superior person. I don't care. <laughs> so do what I don't do that. But in this that situation. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, w when you now think of the war, you said sometimes you see it in your dreams. What 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 do you think? What, like what do you remember? Which images come to your mind yeah, when you think that, about that? That's that, that more strong situations, uh, mm -hmm. uh, like the the embassy, and w with the with the via, with the, the transports, and the other one without the transport. I uh, I, I 
fire. Like, uh, no, it is not. It is not. It, is, it, uh, it stays there. It stays mm -hmm. there. The other, we have some uh, free mo uh, moments to be happy with that. Uh, with our, I'm gonna so show you the photos with uh, 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 the playing guitar and the, in, in, uh, after the, 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 the most tense situation. Mm -hmm. But no, mo the, 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 we have to be there two years in the, in the Africa. So, so you spent four years there. Four years in the army. And uh, I stay more time then because I have the accident and I, I came to the military hospital in there. Then I return again to, to Angola in, in the, from uh, 71 to 74. Uh, you were telling me that uh, you did yoga and drive somewhere to do yoga in Angola, you would just go somewhere to the bushes or to yes, the jungle? Yes, yes, yeah. Because it, as I, I, I could, I go out from the, the place of the, the military, at close to the river in the morning and I stay there time and time at the end yeah. of the day and I return to the, 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 my room in the, in the... So you would go do yoga somewhere? Yeah, it was incredible. Use. Why? Why explain why it was? Uh... Because it was the nature, connect with the nature. No time, because if there was no war, I could be free to do that. It was no time, and I was to to the yoga study, uh, and the, uh, because you don't have nothing to do, or you put your mind if, if tomorrow they can make and kill me, and if tomorrow I go and kill. Me. In a war, you we have to think about that. Or, or killed or to be killed. So, you know that. With yoga, stop. The situation is here and now. In, in, if you have some dangerous situation, in that kind of war, you have to, to be disponible to do what your reaction is. But if you are not in a direct fighting, uh, you can think, we study there, we have a lot of things. I teach some uh, um, soldiers who was from Karabir to read French, science. We do that after. If you don't have uh, to go out, because we, uh, we suppose you go one week out of the, uh, the, the headquarters. Mm -hmm. uh, you are in the forest, yeah, go, go, go. And then the other week you stay in the quarters to relax. To and then during that time we change. And it, during that time was uh, I could do uh, yoga, and you were still doing yoga by books? You no, no, nowadays I study, I study, but, uh, but I have... Did I, you have some personal uh, experience, like, did you have a personal yeah, experience with this, to a teacher? With, or? Yeah, yeah, with this, the, because I give classes to the ordinary people, to the, the every, you know, city. So what I, uh, I have to do with the experience of yoga is what can you put in that person be... We uh, good with yoga as the nervous system, and why we have two uh, nostrils to breathe and one thing to put uh, to rise, uh, wine, mm -hmm. and just one and two, and the, uh, this is the first thing that we do. We do when we burn, and this is the last thing that we do when we die. We have uh, careful m more or less with the things that we eat and drink. But we never think uh, about the breathing. So when I came to my class, I said to the people, how long to the day you have thinking about your breathing? Oh, professor, never mind. I have to do this and to go there, and I have a problem, and I have to discuss with yeah, this yeah. and this and that. So here you're going to try to do one thing, thinking about your breathing. And your breathing is going to work with your nervous system, parasympathetic and sympathetic system. That's the bass of the yoga and after years of your doing uh, yoga uh, practicing yoga you gonna have in this difficult situations you change your reactions to that situation because the, uh, the system and the breathing comes to do something different to you and if you have some people with uh, with what you discuss usually with practice of yoga, you do, do, you do your uh, point of view, but you are not discussing, you are explaining the things and you feel that you are changed. And when you are changing, you are in concentration. Okay. But I meant more like before you went to Angola, did you have any 
Did you meet any people who were doing asanas? No. So you knew yoga only by books? By books, yes. Then after with two, three fellows, but it was the sequence how to do this. And so all, uh, that, that's, you know, that's remarkable that uh, uh, nowadays you start first meeting some, I mean, it are different experiences. Uh, some people, like me too, I also start from the book and then I w was looking for a teacher. But uh, you spent many years without a teacher yeah, and then only then. much later you met people who were, you know, actually doing... Uh, yes, they have... Uh, 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 they have... Uh, uh, Savannah. They have... Uh, in Savannah, it was my master, George Stobart, who had uh, three disciplines, uh, yoga, uh, with m more uh, connected with uh, Van Elisabeth. George Stobart was from Belgium and uh, Van Elisabeth too. And uh, he, he, he followed, uh, followed the Elizabeth system. And uh, I, when I want to do yoga, it's the Rishikesh way because he comes from Sivananda. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And now the Rishikesh is my yoga, if I can say. But I can do that to the people who are studying yoga. The, uh, I was in the war with the books of, of uh, Professor Irmoj. And every asana, and I have the book with his autograph. Some uh, soldiers of my company died. And if I was against the, the, the God and the good God, the God who the, I definitely say no. And the book of Hermogenes, I have a lot of signs, more or less like uh, Van Elizabeth, maybe more, maybe the, uh, more exercise of uh, breathing, but the books of Van Elizabeth was uh, connected with uh, the disintoxication of the, the, what we eat by Vaman and things mm -hmm. we connect mm -hmm. with Ayurveda. So these books was the, the, the form. And the books of uh, Hermogenes, God, God, Sarvangasana, God, <laughs> Alasana, God, 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 and no, this is not, and I stopped the book. And I, the book was, the things was with a red uh, um, pencil, like yeah, right, right, and, and was the first time I met him here in, in Lisbon, I came to him and I said, Professor, uh, it's an honor to meet you. And I had your book, first edition of your book. Uh, it calls Self Perfection Without the Yoga, it's the, the name of the book. Um, but I stopped uh, the book because uh, I was in the war. In the, the war, I was in your book. And uh, you have God, God, God here and there. And my fellows was killing it. And the God, don't, don't worry, uh, goes on there. And he told me, You have the correct. Because if you are not be able to do with the book with the God, you don't need to do that. But you did. You, did you continue doing yoga? Yes, professor, I do. But not going. Coming back to the war uh, experience. Uh, now, when you think of it, is there, is there anything you regret? No, no. <laughs> because it was the 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 thing that it was the way that I the, of my life. The only thing that I could do, it was maybe it was better to go to Paris. <laughs> <laughs> but that was not doing Bhagavad Gita, not doing yoga. And uh, I was very influenced by my, the, the, the no violence of Mahatma Gandhi. Still, uh, nowadays, I like very much the, the, uh, even uh, Mahatma Gandhi, Luther King, and Louis Armstrong, and uh, Nelson Mandela. It was the thing that I took correct. I was there, uh, I was with one direction to do the things and uh, I could do the best of what I could. Uh, did your family support uh, your decision? To go to... Uh, yes. they, they couldn't do na nothing. Okay. They, they could do another because it was uh, ob obligatory. Ah, okay. It was no no young man. How did they react to the fact that you well, they, they want they was always afraid to have the news your your son was killed in in, in a, a lot of people here thousands of people here families were there so it was always the 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 afraid of my family it was 
when I had the accident, they came, they was, my, fa my father was a, a doctor, and he comes to see what really happens to me. It was a problem in the legs, but I'm, I am here. But my family could do nothing. Yeah. Never could, could have a different thing. If I would ask you, what would you recommend, or what would you say, or what, like having the opportunity, uh, what would you say to the Ukrainian soldiers, and what would you say to the Russian soldiers? Stop the war. But for also for the Ukrainians, because for, for the Russians... No, 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 both. If I have the, the, the both side, side by side, I try to do the Kurukshester, what the first thing to the, they have to do, it was not to have the war. Because I, I, if I have to say in this position, I say to the, the Russians, you are doing not the correct thing. And I say to the Ukrainian army, you are doing the correct thing, is to defend your territory, your country. That's what I would say. Mm -hmm. And then I say, explain with yoga. <laughs> After the war, when you come, came back, what was it, how was it, you know, when you came back? Uh, well, it was not easy because you have four years of being in a system that it was uh, very difficult. To, and then you come to be free. <laughs> and then, well, what I, what I was to do? Well, I, fi I started to finish my studies. Uh, I start to doing more liberty uh, political, uh, and uh, then uh, I start to choose the, the profession, but all is with yoga. Mm -hmm. And then I start to doing Aikido too, uh, yoga I knew, but Aikido comes to me to, uh, in that time with the, the same master, and then Yaido too, and Zazen, uh, and then, but yoga always there. If I have nothing to do, I do yoga. <laughs> then uh, it was not easy because uh, a lot of uh, fellows of uh, the army came and they, they have a lot of problems. The most my friend uh, died with the problems of uh, uh, smoking and so on, never could uh, pass the, the problems of the war. Um, and a lot of uh, people like that. And, and I, they, they always have to, and I always was with uh, yoga. I was, uh, was without seeing a, a lot of them uh, more than 10 years, more than 20 years after the, the end of the, the war. And once I was in the, in the, the, the TV to make a, an interview, and when they told me I was doing something and then uh, I hear the word yoga. And there was yoga, but it is still maybe there. Because, and then I saw in the, t in the, the, the TV, it, you were there because we have no more connection. And he called to the TV. The TV said, oh, this is from the, Europe, from the Portuguese Yoga Federation, so you can connect. And then it called me, and it was after all that, maybe 20 years, we don't, we don't see each other, and we make the lunch, and after we stay until the, the, he, okay, he dies. Right. It was the... Uh, the and how was the country when you came back? Uh, Here in Portugal? Yes. Full, of course, liberty. You suppose you have the dictature for more, the, uh, the, for more than 40 years and suddenly you are free to do everything you want. Everything was uh, everything free, go here and uh, happy times. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, <laughs> it's the benefits of democracy. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's not perfect, but it's the thing that you can do the things you organize and do and expose your position. I, I have to expose my position that yoga can help the, the, the living of the person. And that's what I find everywhere. And actually, coming back to the war, uh, when we were talking yesterday, you were uh, saying that... Uh, you also were in the hospital, and you were uh, yes uh, talking about yoga and uh, in, with doing some some fellows in, without the, without arms, without yes, yes. legs, and they saw me because I was with, with the, some in some uh, uh, identical condition, but I even when I have the, the leg closed, um, I do yoga. <laughs> Yeah, and then yeah, with the problems, and they say, why can you be so happy? <laughs> why can you be so like that? And you are with high, high, high. They say, yes, I could, but you are without a leg. You are without a uh, heart. How can, how do you are doing, how you are suffering maybe? More? But we are feeling better to see you doing that. So you come to do what you can. 
Yeah. You have no arms, you have, but you can breathe. You can breathe. Yoga is breathing. And in the starting of breathing, you have... And then during that time, I, I help and I do some yoga classes. One, not with the leg, not with the legs, with no arms. You breathe, you think, you have. And I read books of the form. You yeah, read, other, you read books for them? For them, I read books. If they, could, they have no arms, and I read books. I had nothing to do to be in the hospital, so I go with... The, the, you were in a wheelchair. Yeah, and I, okay. and I go to close. Now I'm going to read you a story of Bhagavad Gita. Oh, no, no, no more there. Now I'm going to read you something of, from Shakespeare. Now read something different. Read. But they are like, oh, they call me. I'm like, Figueiredo, come to, to read your story because I put always something uh, nice to, to, to read. And, mm -hmm. and then we, maybe we discuss. Because when we're in the hospital, we have um, papers in newspapers. The, 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 the parties was forbidden in Portugal. And no, nobody could inside that. Because if someone entered in the military hospital with, uh, to try to arrest someone who has no arm, who has no leg, never mind. Ne ne they could not do that. They, they knew that we have that... Uh, papers against the government, but never try to go there because inside of that week, I, I don't know what happened. <laughs> so the government was afraid to yes to go to, to, go, to, to people do, who were injured in, in, in the war. Yes. And they, people who were injured in the war, they could read. Read everything uh, we talk about that. I, I, uh, in the, the lunch, I had Karl Marx books, uh, <laughs> Capital, in here. And the, some uh, officials said, hey, it's uh, me and others with the books. Hey, that's not uh, permitted. You go to the. No, I stay in this book with here. Come to imprison me. No, never. Never. They called it everything. It was so strong. That you know, in, in Ukraine, uh, Karl Marx and uh, Capital is uh, uh, after the years of communism yeah yeah no. it, it feels like very negative yeah, yeah. and it's so uh, but in that time for yeah. us in that time for and us for you it was forbidden to, and because you, it was such a <coughs> urge to read something yeah, to, like yeah. this because uh, I, uh, I i read books of lenin too and uh, he, uh, like this and the other philosopher of occidental but uh, in the in the hospital, we could have that books. Nobody can can take it up. If I came out with them, well, there was a problem. But inside of the, the hospital, and, uh, with the hospital, no problem. Um, and the, here in Portugal, it was always God and God and, and uh, Fatima, a place, uh, say, uh, Catholic place, and we do, could not, not do nothing that could be materialist with a dialectic materialism, and the only thing that we have as dialectic, it was from Freud, something of the, the psychoanalysis, mm -hmm. and the dialectic of the psychoanalysis, it was the only thing that we could read, more or less, not, mm -hmm. not, not too much. But when we have that books, nowadays I don't, I don't, uh, I don't care <laughs> about it. Okay. But I never defend, uh, it was just to see what, but this is okay, it's a study, mm -hmm. it's a, not to be uh, as a principal. And it was more to see, I have a forbidden book here. <laughs> so after coming back from war and you have the democracy in Portugal, when was, uh, what, when you started your first class? Of yoga? Berlin? Yes. Well, maybe in 95, 96, well, because... It's pretty, pretty late. Uh, but, but I was doing it because I have a professor and a, a master, and I come to the, the, the class of the give. Mm -hmm. And uh, one day, my professor says, I have no it was in Coimbra, I have no conditions to, co to continue here because it's difficult to, to come, and you're going to be my su substitute. And then I studied with them. I came to Lisbon to work uh, every week uh, how to give a, a yoga class. And then I start with that until today. Okay. And uh, after you came back from war, how, when did you start your first class as a student? Like when was the first, like uh, your teacher uh, in yoga? Uh, in, it was, was in, in 1981, 82. Ah, okay, so this is the... Yeah. Okay. Then I started uh, more than 10 years working. When did you meet 
uh, European Union and uh, did you meet? Uh, uh, after we are starting to create the uh, Portuguese Yoga Federation. Okay. It, it was me that decided to do the Portuguese Yoga Federation. It was something that we see nowadays. Uh, every a person could be a teacher, everybody could be teacher of yoga uh, in uh, one man, one month, uh, one weekend, one, uh, I don't know. And then with my master and uh, the other persons, old persons who are doing yoga more than 20 years, eh? if this goes in this way, and there are no one institution that could be a uh, defender or could put the yoga in the correct way of teaching and practice, uh, this is be a disaster. And so my master says, if you want, if you are a Kurukshastra, if you like to, to, to say to that you are doing this and that, why don't you do an, a federation to defend the yoga as a correct way? And then I start. And we have an association in Porto, in Lisbon one, and in Sintra another, in Coimbra and Santarém. And we start doing a federation. Mm -hmm. But to be recognized a federation in Portugal, we must, to be, and have the public utility, we must to belong to an, an international institution recognized too. That, was, that is the case of the European Union. And then uh, we start connection, we are like this, and then they say we have to, to alter the statutes uh, to be accepted here, and then... And How many years did you have? How many years did it take to, organ, you know, to have the fine, uh, you know, when it was already official that you have the federation, Portuguese federation of yoga? I don't remember exactly, but it was started in the 1995-6, uh, and because it was officially um, opened, the Portuguese Yoga Federation, in, in May of 2000. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. nowadays we have 20, in May we do 23 years of existence. After that, maybe four years or maybe more to be uh, published in the official um, book of the government that we are the recognized as utility okay. public. Okay. And after that, the, the European Union, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. Later, with uh, Joana, who is now in the, later, he said, okay, you are in conditions to be recognized as the uh, representative of yoga in, in Portugal. Okay. So it was okay. very hard, very hard. <laughs> to, to be admitted by the European Union? Yes. Okay. Very hard. Yeah, yeah you know, the <laughs> <laughs> uh, now I understand also how it is done um, from the inside. But um, when was your first... Zinal. When we, when was it? The, which year was it when you first went to maybe twenty for the seminar 20, for the congress in yeah. Zinal? Twenty eight or twenty no twenty eleven I think twenty ten mm -hmm. I don't remember it was so about uh, twenty years after you like yeah it was we we knew the European we knew that it was Gerald Blitz and Van Elizabeth to do that and when we saw that and see that okay that's the the the, the, the institution that we want to go and they went to see how to do that and, and the, why did you choose European Union uh, to in that join? time I th in that time I think that it was no no other in uh, international organization later it comes others but. In that time, I think it was. Did you meet Van Lisbeth before? Before, uh, before European Union. Yeah, yeah. Not, I don't meet the personally Van Lisbeth, but I knew about him. I was to go to Belgium, but I never had the chance to go to Belgium to work with him. But I, it was from my master who uh, teach me. I have all books of Van Lisbeth, all books mm -hmm. <laughs> of Van Lisbeth. Okay, Andre. And uh, when you first went, what was your impression? W when? When you w first went to Zinal uh, and you know had the well, it was good, experience. but it was not not easy because I, I was there. It, it was very good because a lot of teachers, different ways to teach yoga or to be practicing. It was uh, very, very, very good. Very, it's very good. So you teach yoga for so many years now. Uh, did you see the change in the students? Uh, like, I mean, for example, in 1980s, 
students were different and now they're different or in 2011 now i don't know where they are <laughs> okay you know, because it's it, that's why my my preoccupation about the, the to have a, a strong teaching of yoga basic story if you go to have a, a, a medicine course you have the base to be a medicine uh, all students in, in the different university has the same curriculum to study medicine uh, electricity, um, engineer, mm -hmm. architecture, they have the same base. After that, you can be cirurgian, you can be orthopedist, you can be uh, different uh, specialty. And that makes w the, the government have the attention to, the, uh, to the, uh, the something that exists for the society. But now what we have? You go there, yeah, where do you teach yoga? I was with a friend that was and give me the diploma. I was one week with Alliance somewhere and now I have a diploma. <laughs> but uh, if we come back to the question uh, how the people changed. Uh, so could you, did you see like different stages of change or... In the like, student. Because 50 years is, is a lot yes. of years, you know, of yeah, teaching. That's, that's my... Uh, that's, I mean, you have 50 years, 50, over 50 years of uh, yoga practice and uh, what, uh, from 81, uh, 83 you said, so it's uh, uh, over 30 years of teaching. Yeah, but I don't have the same the students uh, after 30 No, but, but maybe you, you saw, like, because different people come to class. Yeah, and different, and different they different can, people they go. questions. Uh, what, how would you describe the problems that people come with or how the questions they come with? What, what's the... Different ways, different ways. Some come for curiosity, some come from the, the, the indications of the doctors, um, psychoanalyst uh, or uh, orthopedist, they come to do yoga. And the same came to, to be the, um, the gymnastic. Uh, way to do exercise, physical exercise to do. So with, nothing really changed. Uh, uh, no, later, nowadays? later it changed. Oh, how? So the, the, some people came. To, I, I was here because my doctor says to do that. I came here to yoga because I read a book and it was interesting. But now it is really changing me. What is yoga? And then I can. Well, you can read this book. You can study this part, you can study Upanishad, you can read that, and you can discuss that with me, and if I have the experience to answer to you, I, I'm going to say, what is my experience in that mm -hmm. reference? Mm -hmm. And then they come and say, but you have to do yoga. If you don't do yoga, you don't have the, the change that yoga can propose. That the purpose of yoga is to go to Samadhi. And that's not easy to do that. As you are a child and they say to you, you're going to be a big uh, guy and you're going to be a big minister, you're going to be a big doctor, you're going to be a big musician, you're going to be something when you are an adult. But you must eat, you must dance, you must cry, you must uh, do everything. Every day you have to do something to come to adult. And then yoga is the same. If you want to have some revelation, something different of this quotidian life, you have to do yoga because you are not doing yoga. He, you offer, I see this water, I can drink this water, but I don't know what this water is going to do in my cell. In my cell, I, I don't know what happens to the oxygen and that, but I know that the organism do that because since I was a child, I drink water. And I'm never going to th thought about the chemical composition of that. Mm -hmm. If you do yoga, empty yoga, and this uh, nutrish me. Eh? It's going to be nutrition for me. And if you do yoga, breathing right, left, left, is the change that you, you read in the book. If you read from the Ida Pingala, uh, Sushumna and Knadi, you have this effect and this effect. Well, okay, it's nice. But if you start, you do every day, do the yoga, later something happens. Maybe you are not in the yoga class. Maybe you are doing something in the street and maybe you are trying to do something against someone. Oh, that guy. And suddenly, inside of you, you couldn't be not aggressive. You, it, that yoga working. Mm -hmm. But it's not the end of yoga. It's the end. The yoga working like the food that we, we eat every day. Okay. That, okay. 
And uh, one more topic that I want to discuss with you, because I see many similarities between uh, Ukrainian Federation and the Portuguese Federation. So pretty much in the same period we registered, because in Ukraine, Ukrainian Federation was also registered pretty much in the same years. 99, 2000, it, it was the process of registration uh, by the government. And, uh, and one more thing, one similarity we have uh, uh, is um, you were saying that uh, you also do um, Aikido. And uh, my teacher is also uh, doing Aikido and does yoga. Interesting, very interesting. Yes. So I, I wanted to ask you about your Aikido experience and how it is connected with your yoga teaching. You know, the founder of the Aikido is, uh, it was Muryeu Yeshiba. And Muryeu Yeshiba had a, a big connection with the Chinese working, the, the Tai Chi. And he started to, uh, to, to see the, the origins of the Tai Chi came from India, from the Kalari Payat. And uh, he saw that you're going to see some uh, parts of uh, it was my last work to the, because in the Portuguese Yoga Federation, uh, sorry, in the Portuguese Aikido Federation, if you want to go with teaching Aikido, you have to, three, four years, you have to do, uh, defend your, your teaching and, and your way. And he, uh, he has a, a, a point of, we, we sit in the Upanishads, and he, he has the one, one, um, uh, student, it was uh, called uh, Stephen, John Stevens, who works and put the, um, the um, Yoga Sutras of Patanjali, the Ashtanga Yoga, with the Ashtanga Aikido. Mm -hmm. The same steps that are in the, the yoga, is in the book, he had the same steps that we have in Aikido. And the only thing that is original in the Aikido is that you don't gonna fight, you gonna eliminate the fight. You create the vid in the in the in the the akasha the, in the in the in the with Aikido. In the other martial arts, I, I had to do um, karate, uh, and in the others, if you someone gives you a strike, you answer with another strike. Mm -hmm. With Aikido, if one gives a strike, you do the harmony. And you, you, you change the form of the attack and the, the attackant the, gives up to the attack and can be in harmony with you. In yoga, we have the same because we, we're going to start doing one asana and you stay there two minutes and you start fighting if you want to, to be more time in that position because you want to study the position. Not really this position came to me like we... So uh, Tamini says in this book that to have the effect of one position, because Patanjali don't says one position, this position, that position. The position, the asana, must be stira stukam, comfortable. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, uh, and then he says, uh, Tamini says that we must stay in the one position to have the all uh, steps of the Astanga Yoga, for hours and 20 minutes, something like that. Okay. Yeah, timeless yoga. And, uh, you know, uh, my teacher, he has invented uh, a methodology of, of a psychological Aikido, and we do it in yoga. So you have it in your uh, communication, you have it in your, uh, uh, like, talk, uh, how you can use the energy of one person and the other. Uh, to, you know, so if you have aggression coming from one person, but not, you know, the physical mm, part of aggression, but the verbal. Uh, verbal aggression, how you can use it to answer. And it's, it's, it's not, you know, it's not something you can explain easily. It's like he has a book on this. I, I have thought about that because it is, sometimes it happens. Familiarity, uh, friendly, mm -hmm. Politically, because I'm, I, 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 I like to discuss politics too. And there are one thing. First of all, you have the hara 
in, in Aikido that is more referenced that in yoga, but yoga you have the chakras, is the same. That if you are uh, in ara with, uh, with aggressivity, the ara says to you, stop. And there are the other things comes directly from yoga, is the breathing. You be aggressive verbal for me, and I'll do like this, I have a, a reaction, not a, an action. You came aggressive to me, and I'm being with Ara, and then slop, slowly, the breathing. Mm -hmm. And then the other, rah, rah, rah. Yeah, my fellow, I don't agree with that. Well, we must go there. And he, but I have some person to try to do that with me, some, uh, especially in, uh, in, uh, in uh, conversations and the persons who don't do neither Aikido, neither yoga. My friends, uh, my family, my brother, and they try to do, you remember that thing? You know? Oh, yes, I remember. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, this guy, wow. <laughs> Well, uh, I, maybe we translate the book of uh, my teacher, Andrei Safronov, uh, to English, and maybe if we yeah. do that, I would share it, because he has a methodology for that, and it's, um, you know... It's important. Uh, to switch between chakras, to answer the attack. I cannot explain it or describe it in few words, because it takes yeah, usually very many interested. hours uh, to, to explain yeah. and to practice, because it's a practical thing. Yeah. But uh, uh, it's nice to have, uh, you know, some kind of uh, a connection also in this field, you know. Uh, yeah. uh, although we're uh, worlds apart, but uh, yoga, Aikido, the, you know, the spiritual practice, individual spirituality is uh, the, these ideas. Well, you see that in, in uh, we know the, in Aikido, in yoga we say prana, in the Tai Chi, Qigong we say Chi in Japanese, and in, in Aikido we say Ki. It's the same energy, and, uh, uh, working in different uh, ways, but it's the same energy. The chi, the ki, the prana. What I say to my students in yoga, because ah, it's, uh, when you do Aikido, it's more easy to understand the force. It's, the the prana is not a force, it's energy. And it's, you, you, if you do, if you practice yoga, there are a different way that you feel, even in the winter, even in, in the summer, you, there are one thing that you are feeling, the energy is the same. And uh, maybe the last question, uh, how would you describe, is, is there a, um, some kind of Portuguese attitude to yoga? In, do, no, does Portu does Portu uh, Portugal and the, its people and its culture had somehow influenced I don't yoga. think so. It's a, it's a, a modality, it's contemporary. They like to do yoga because it's relaxed. Someone likes the yoga because it gives money <laughs> and well-being, something like that. Everybody knows yoga. I ask to the people when they come, ah, well, professor, they say that I can experience one class of yoga. May I? Do you know what is yoga? Yes, I know. <laughs> they did so first, but they don't go to this yoga, so it's like that, it's like a sport, it's like okay. something okay. like that, yeah. yeah. Okay, so thank, thank you, my dear, for thank your, you. for thank your you stories and, and the, uh, uh, you know, the stories, the experience, you know, for sharing it. Uh, it and, is uh, uh, my pleasure, it was my pleasure, my honor, and I thank you. It's the nice team. meeting thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> and we'll see each other. Yeah. Thank you.